Mr. Science is here with some Thanksgiving ideas and some experiments. Mm -hmm. So uh, what did you bring for us? You know, kids are out during this time of the year for Thanksgiving break, and parents are always looking for ways to keep them busy, especially as they're trying to cook the turkey, the uh -huh. stuffing, and all the Thanksgiving goodies. Yeah. Here's some ideas, some Good. tricks that you can use to help the kids, or for that matter, if you just want to do it with the family. Yeah. Uh, I have a bag here that you might store some food in. You know, you eat all that oh, turkey, yes. you have some leftovers. Mm -hmm. The question is how many pencils can you get through this bag without it spewing and going all over the place? You want me to poke pencils You're going to poke pencils right through. This has oh to do gosh. with matter. Anything okay. that takes up space and has mass. We have a liquid on the inside. Okay. The pencil's a solid. There's a little gas up here, of course. Okay. Now, when you do this, make sure you're not jabbing and pulling. So you're going to push <laughs> it through gently, go all the way through, and the small pieces that make up the bag are going to hold hands around the pencil. Cross your fingers. Oh my gosh. Are you gosh. ready to try okay, it? The pressure is on. Okay, here we go. Oh Three. My. Slowly, slowly. Are you sure oh, about this? Oh, I don't this? know. I'm a little nervous. Okay. okay, we'll try it. Three, two, one, go. Don't pull back out, by the way. And look at oh that. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So we got one. Okay. How many more? Okay. Not leaking yet. I'm feeling more confident now. Here's two. Okay, you got two in there. Pretty cool, right? Okay. Here's three. This is just recycled toilet water. Here's four. <laughs> Look at that. We got four oh pencils goodness. in there. Oh, this is fun. Five. Now that I've gotten over my uh, uh, stress of this spewing Six. all over us, it's You fun. think you're going to get them all? I think I can do it all. Seven. Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's get one over here. Eight. <sighs> Just three left. Nine. Ten. Last one. Here we go. Eleven. Ooh. Yes. Wow, look at that. Yeah, you were able to get all so these pencils. Cool. It's leaking a little bit, but would you not leak if you had this many exactly. pencils in you? Exactly, yes. What's happening is the small pieces that make up the bag are holding hands together tightly around the pencil. Now, the problem is, is if you take these back out, that's not going <laughs> to seal back up. And all of that water is going to come spewing out all over the place. Okay, so, so let's keep them in there. Keep them in there and yeah. let's just set it down just like that. Now, Good I know idea. you love explosions, right? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. So I have a few ingredients that you might use okay. for cooking Thanksgiving dinner. Some baking soda, some vinegar, some sandwich bags. Oh, yeah, all paper things towels, we have in our kitchen. Everything that's around the house. You know, that's the purpose of Hooked on Science, to show families and teachers you don't need Bunsen burners and right. beakers and Erlenmeyer flasks. To do science, you already have right. everything at home. Right. So we're going to mix together these two ingredients to create a chemical reaction. That chemical reaction will create a gas that should make our sandwich bag explode. <gasps> You still got to do some TV stuff after this? Uh, yeah. There's Should I be a little worried? There's that you it's might get, get a little messy. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't want to get messy, I'll hold it for you. Okay. But I'm going to open it up. Again, matter. This is a liquid. This is a solid. Scooping up some gas in the studio. That's called air. Okay. What we're going to do first is you're going to take your paper towel and you're going to pour some baking soda on it. Kids, before doing any science at home, have an adult around, wear the appropriate safety gear. Do not okay. eat or drink your science experiment. How Reminders. much? How much, right? Mm -hmm. Well, it's your experiment. I want you to try different ways. We call that variable. So you'll notice what I did there. I'll let you hold that. Okay. It's a package, right? Uh -huh. <laughs> From Santa. <laughs> a baking soda. <laughs> Next, I'm going to take my vinegar and I'm going to pour it in. Don't worry about the amount just yet. Don't go by the instructions specific in science anymore. Okay. We let kids explore and experience mm -hmm. the science. That's the fun of it. That is. You think that's enough? It's your experiment or more? <sighs> Maybe just a little more. A little bit more? Okay, if you create a big explosion and you get all vinegary smelling. <laughs> okay, drop it in. Is it going to explode now? Not yet. But Not yet, okay. Are you sure? ah, I don't know. <laughs> okay, drop it in. Okay. Now what's happening is we're allowing that paper towel to slow down that reaction. But what's going to happen is I mix everything together. Uh -huh. You'll notice the bag is expanding. <gasps> yes. Step back. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Now the question is, will it explode? Oh. <laughs> there it goes right there. <laughs> so yeah, we mixed those ingredients together and we created an explosion all because of carbon dioxide gas that kind of uh, built up inside of that bag and made it expand. So we had the solid, we had the liquid, and a gas that built up on the inside. Do I smell delicious? Yeah. Um, our, my coworkers will want to stay a little farther away from I me. I think they might do that. Yes, because of the vinegar. But what fun. Kids love to make a mess and if they it's a do. mess they're learning something I think the parents can't complain 
No, I think you're exactly right. And, I mean, look, do it in the kitchen, just yeah. try not to do it on the couch, or do it in a friend's couch. Right, you yeah. Know, <laughs> overall. There you go. This one here is a pretty cool one. We all love bubbles. We know right. that bubbles are fun. Mm -hmm. We fill them full of air. Uh, you put a glove on. We are going okay. to bounce a bubble back and forth. Now, this glove here is oh, going to wow. help us protect the bubble. Okay. It has to be a cotton glove. So okay. at that time of the year, when we start to get cold, we go to our local department store, we get our fuzzy glove. It's okay. a cotton glove. Over here, I have some ingredients. Basically, I made my own bubble solution. The best bubble solution ever is dish detergent, okay. water, and corn syrup. Okay, things Those we all have in our kitchen. things will create some bubbles that will last a little longer than usual, especially the corn syrup. Corn syrup, that's the key that's for that one? That's very important. Okay. If uh, you don't have corn syrup and you go to the health aisle in your local department store, you'll find glycerin. That'll do okay. the same thing. It helps the okay. bubble stay inflated, if you will, a little bit longer. Okay. I'm going to blow a bubble. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> <gasps> Next, there. I'm going to try to bounce it, so I'm going to pass it over to you. Oh, my gosh. Oh, there we go. It's not breaking. It is oh, not. It might oh, now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so what's happening there is on our hands, we have oil, we have dirt, and as right. soon as that bubble hits it, it pops almost immediately. We have one more, a little bit more time to blow yeah. another bubble. As you're working on that one, if families want to find more science experience, experiments like Oops. this they can do while the kids are home, uh, where can they find them? At the website, hookedonscience.org. Uh -huh. When you go there, all you got to do is <laughs> click on the experiment guide section. There's actually one called Holiday STEM, and you're going to find experiments for Easter, Christmas, <gasps> Thanksgiving. And it's all for free. So go check it out. Sweet. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. I'm in communities all across the area mm -hmm. getting kids excited about science. Yeah, and that's what it's all about, having fun mm -hmm. and learning. And yeah. making messes. At, perfect. <laughs> Parents love me, right? <laughs> we love when you stop by and let us make a few messes mm -hmm. here. Great to see you. You too. <laughs>